Welcome to airconditionerlab.com. Our website and YouTube channel discuss everything you need to know about HVAC. From heating and cooling to air quality and cleaning, you will find the most informative HVAC content to help you understand these systems. You might be asking yourself, what exactly is a heat pump? In this video, we break down the key components, the different types, and how they work to heat your home. Let's get started. First, we will discuss the five core mechanisms that make up a heat pump. We have condenser, the compressor, evaporator, air handler, and the reversing valve. The compressor sits in the condensing unit outside the home. It is the heart of the system, continuously pumping refrigerant through the lines. The condenser houses the compressor and condenser fan. Its primary job is to move air from outside the home over the refrigerant coils. The evaporator is housed inside the mini-split unit on the wall. It is responsible for absorbing the heat from the air in your home. The air handler has just one job, and that is to pull air in from the room, pass it through the evaporator coils, and then circulate the heated air back into the room. The reversing valve controls the directional flow of the compressor. In cooling mode, the refrigerant moves in one direction, sending cold refrigerant to the evaporator. In heating mode, the valve switches directions, forcing the compressor to run backward, pulling the hot refrigerant from the evaporator so it can warm the air inside. Now, let's take a minute to learn about the different types of heat pumps. We'll discuss air, water, and ground source systems. Air source heat pumps are the most common type found in homes. They consist of an external condensing unit and pump with an interior evaporator and air handler. They work in a similar way to a mini split AC system. The compressor pressurizes the refrigerant, which is passed through the evaporator where the air is heated or cooled. During the heating process, the valve reverses and the warmth is moved to the evaporator where it heats the air. It works as a heat exchanger between the outside air and the refrigerant. The refrigerant enters the evaporator as a low-pressure liquid. The boiling point of this liquid is cooler than the temperature of the outside air. This raises the heat and pressure, allowing the rest of the system to distribute that heat as needed. During the summer, the process is reversed and the heat pump absorbs warm air from your home and transfers it outside. Then, the compressor pushes the air to the evaporator where it is cooled by refrigerant and circulated back into the home as cool, refreshing AC. This system is also referred to as an air-to-air -air heat pump. In recent years, the technology behind these heating and cooling units has come a long way and homeowners are reaping the benefits. Be warned though, they are not always 100% reliable. Here are some pros and cons of residential air source heat pumps. Advantages of installing a heat pump. Energy efficient. Does not use any gas. Low on noise. Works all year round. Disadvantages of installing a heat pump. Unreliable in below zero temperatures. High initial cost. Reliant on electricity. Next, we have water source heat pumps. There are two different types, closed and open loop systems. The first type is the most common and is often referred to as a water to water system. They work by passing water and vapor refrigerant through a pipe to the heat pump in a continuous cycle. An open loop system draws water from an external source, generally a lake, river, or aquifer, where it is then passed through the system to the heat exchanger and into the home. Now, let's discuss ground source heat pumps. They use a closed loop system of piping and can be used for heating air or water. Inside the pipes is a mixture of water and refrigerant. As the pump circulates the mixture, it absorbs the heat from the ground around the pipes, moving it through the system where the heat is then transferred to the home. There you have it, our complete breakdown of heat pumps and how they work. I hope this video helped explain the basics of how this HVAC system works. If you enjoyed learning about heat pumps with Air Conditioner Lab, remember to like this video and subscribe to this channel.